Hi viewers, welcome back. Uh, this is a morning time. You can say I came to this one machine. This is a Volvo 2 L220 HV loader. Uh, this loader has the parking brake is not uh, removing, is not releasing. Came this uh, wheel loader inside the cabin. You can see this is a is a one when I own the machine and try to release the brake. So this park brake failure warning has appeared on it. So now I'm going to diagnose it. This is my park brake. Okay, this time park brake is applied. So I'm going to release the park brake. So now I release the park brake, but here you can see uh, this is a park brake light is still there. So I know, so still I do nothing. So this warning has also appeared. So you can see the uh, spark brake failure is coming. Okay. So now I try to shift the gear. So this time my gear is in a neutral position. I go forward. I put the forward. But here you can see is a, when I put the gear in forward direction. So again an other warning coming. Applied park brake. Here park brake is not released. Park brake is still applied. So now I'm going to remove my shifter to neutral position, pushing the gear reverse. But you can hear the sound and also this sound is also coming. Applied parking brake. So park brake is applied, still park brake is not releasing. So the warning is coming, park brake is applied. So I remove the park brake and put the gear reverse and this warning is also coming. So I'm going to check what is the issue to this one. Okay, so now I check the code if any code is coming. So here you can see we can select the this button. I select it. When I select it, so code you can see here's my code is coming. Park brake failure code is active yes, and error code is coming C one zero 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 zero. Source is a GP. M E C U 3 So views I don't have any way to decode this code because the manuals which I have there is not written anything about this code so I just use the diagram and by using diagram I check all the components which are related in the park braking circuit so first I show you the diagram after we will try to diagnose this problem this one is our diagram regarding the park brake. So first I do this one is our computer GPMECU3 and this one showing the negative voltages and here are our positive voltages. This one is our park brake switch SW5501 and this one is our park brake valve and solenite MA5501 and this one is our spring park brake spring when we applied the park brake the power is finished and this spring is pushing to the park brake disc and park brake is applied and this one is our relay which re 5502 and this one is our pressure sensor which is installed on the park brake block se 5501 okay so now I'm going to check all the components. So just I found that this relay is the RE5502. This relay of also uh, present in the parking brake circuit. So I found that this relay is... I tested this relay is working good. It have no problem. Uh, so I will show you how I test it. Okay, you can see this is space between this strip and this point is the space 
maybe you see or not but this this time is a de-energized so when we start the machine and uh, release the switch so this machine this uh, relay is uh, become the energized uh, yes now you can see this is uh, at this point this point you can see the relay is showing the uh, this is space between this one in this area you can see this is very space so this time this relay is uh, de-energized the pin number 87 and 30 is in open position so now i'm going to start the loader and uh, i will also uh, show you my switch will be work switch will be in uh, in applied position so i'm going to start circuit so my switch is in. this is my switch is in I have removed a fuse back. This my switch is in uh, applied position, and here you can see contact are closed. Okay, so here you can see before the contact was open, his space was here space, but now the contact is closed. So now I am going to release the switch. Okay. You can see that this is a is close contact. Me pin, pin number thirty seven, uh, so thirty and eighty seven is uh, connected. See, my this relay is not de-energized. I relay. so viewers, you have seen when my loader was in off position, the contents of the relays are open. I mean pin number eighty. 7 and 30 was open there it's mean the relay was a de-energized but as soon as i start the loader so relay become energized and pin number 80 7 and 30 are closed and it will closed whenever the wheel loader is in a starting positions and in this way they give the continuously power through the Park brake solenoid to for releasing the park brake. It means my relay is a good one, and my switch. This switch is also good. I check this power have there, but still my parking brake is not releasing. So now I'm going to check other components which are uh, present, yeah, which are involved in the parking brake circuit. This one is the pressure sensor which installed on the parking brake uh, block uh, this uh, connector of this uh, sensor so I check the voltages here the feed voltages are coming the 5 volt so this one is the park brake solenoid and the park brake valve so I checked this one is also working <coughs> there's are no problem but problem I only doubt on the pressure sensor which are uh, installed on the power brick wall so i'm going to change that sensor then afterward i will check the result now oh, i have changed this one where then i remove from the one sensor from the other uh, machine and fix it here okay so i change this sensor replace the sensor with the other other sensor this i fix this sensor okay i remove this sensor from the other machine so i fix it back so now i'm going to inside and checking my problem is solved or not okay so this sensor I replaced with the other machine I show you the machine for where I removed this sensor and I put there actually I removed sensor from here you can see opened up from here okay I removed this uh, sensor from here and I put the other machine which had a problem now I'm going to inside and uh, check my problem is solved or not. Machine, I'm going to start the machine. So machine is started. You can see the is now a machine is in park position. I'm going to release the. Okay, so I release the. So you can see the sign has finished. 
again applied the I applied okay so park brake is applied I remove I'm going to release the park brake so no park brake is released so my problem is solved so it's mean the problem was the the pressure sensor which installed on the block of the park brake okay that sensor is gave the signals to the ECM and uh, requested to release the park brake so this sign is finished so my problem is solved okay so problem is was uh, this is sensor so I show you now I am going, going to move a little uh, okay so now I am going to uh, little move video please don't forget my don't to forget subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends